All right, boys. Moving along this week on the Don't Tell Mama Sports Podcast. We got our game picks, Max. It's yeah. week one. It's week one starting tonight. Let's go. Thursday, the 7th of September. We got approximately an hour until kickoff. Ooh, less than that. 50 minutes on the clock. 50 hopefully, minutes on the clock. Hopefully I can get this out here before kickoff. It's not happening, but it will it'll be edited tonight. <laughs> on NBC Thursday night Ooh. football. We got the defending champions, the Kansas City Chiefs taking on the Detroit Lions. Both of these teams are division winners for me. We just got breaking news right before we came on here that Travis Kelsey has been ruled out, Max. You know, that's big news. That's big, big news. news, but that's not enough to sway me off of Patty Mahomes. He's undefeated in season openers, I believe 18 touchdowns in five games. I'm going the Chiefs and Patty's at home and Patty at home. We'll make this quick. I also got Patty Mahomes and the Chiefs. I think they just figure it out. You never count these guys out. I'm telling you, whoever is hurt, other than Patty Mahomes, if Patty Mahomes is hurt, then then you're gonna be like, okay, well, I'll I'll pick the other team. But if Patty Mahomes is in. And Andy Reid is coaching. Give me the Chiefs. Give me the Chiefs. Moving along to Sunday. Our morning games out here. We're going to start in New Orleans. The Saints are going to host the Tennessee Titans. Ooh, and Derrick Henry. Fun. A juicy one. Juicy game. one. At Tennessee? In New Orleans. New Orleans. In New Orleans. Yeah. Max, I think uh, Derek Carr needs at least a week to get acclimated to his new team. Tennessee's ready to roll Titans with a week one slight upset because the Saints are favored in this game. Okay. Uh, I will also go with the Tennessee Titans. I got to give it to the King. He is still the King. I love Derrick Henry and that running game. It could, I mean, I, I know that uh, apparently the Saints are supposed to have a de decent defense. I got to see it against the King. That'll be a good one. Moving along. We got the Atlanta Falcons in a divisional showdown hosting the Carolina Panthers. Fun. Uh, Bryce Young making his debut on the road. I'm going Atlanta, Max. Also going Atlanta. I think it's a big game uh, from Bajan Robinson. We'll talk more about him later. Moving along, staying in the morning games, we got Joe Burrow and the Bengals going on the road, play division divisional rival, the Cleveland Browns. Oh, now, fun. Good games. Good Bengals games. Are, Bengals are only a two-and-a-half point favorite in this one. This one, this one smells a little bit, but I ain't going upset. I'm going Bengals. Go Bengals. Joe Burrow is healthy. Expect three touchdowns from Joe Burrow. Ooh. At least. Whoa, whoa, whoa. At, At least. least. Easy. <laughs> uh, staying with a divisional matchup here, Max. We got the Jaguars going on the road to take on the Colts in Indianapolis. This might be a smacking in Anthony Richardson's debut. I'm going Jaguars. Jaguars easily. Uh, the Jaguars are going to take, take a nice duke right in the middle of that field. And uh, Anthony Richardson, just don't step in it. I don't, you know, just, you know, take the loss like a man. You don't have to step in that. Only a five point favorite Jacksonville is. I might be taking, I may be taking those points there. Jacksonville, I, I think and pound them. Uh, moving along, we got Baker Mayfield making his Tampa Bay debut. Your queef in the division. He's going on the road to take on the Minnesota Vikings. Vikings all the way. Vikings, baby. They're going to, they're going to score a lot of points against them. Staying in the morning games, we got the 49ers taking on the Pittsburgh Steelers. This is going to be a pounding, Ooh. probably a low score. Ooh. We got an over-under of 41 total points in this one. We we talked about earlier, Nick Bosa is back because of that. Going 49ers on the road, Max. Ooh, man. This is going to be a better game than, than you think. I think it's going to be a big defensive game. Okay. I think the 49ers, they have probably arguably the best defense in the game. Uh but Pittsburgh always has a good defense and you know, it, it definitely makes you nervous about Brock Purdy and then what Kyle Pickett, but I'm going to go definitely with the 49ers with Christian McCaffrey and Brock Purdy. I mean, he, he was five and zero as a starter. So come on, definitely go Brock, uh, 49ers. A couple of queef quarterbacks there, Brock Purdy mm -hmm. and Kenny Pickett, a couple of yeah. queefs. Uh, staying in the morning games, we got the Arizona Cardinals just named Joshua Dobbs. They're starting QB. They're going to go to take on Washington, the Salamanders. Over under in this game is 38. This is going to be ugly. Do not have it on your TV. No. Washington Salamanders are going to win this game, though. Cardinals suck. I, I, it's such a 
bum. They they might be the worst team in the game. This, you know, what's the funny thing is that these might be the two worst teams playing each other in the in game in the first week. So you're basically playing for who is not going to be the worst team in the league. Uh, I I also got with the Washington uh, the Washington Queeps football. Queeps. I, I jumped on FanDuel today and hit the under on Arizona's four and a half wins. I don't see them getting five wins this Ooh. year. So fuck fuck the Cardinals. Kyler Murray, he's out. Probably playing video games. Playing video games. We don't know when we'll see Kyler Murray, if we'll see him this year. I don't know. Who knows? Last game in the morning slot on Sunday, fellas. We got the Baltimore Ravens hosting the Houston Texans. Baltimore's mm-hmm. a nine and a half point favorite. I believe the biggest favorite on the week. Baltimore in a smashing. CJ Stroud making his debut. Uh, yeah, I think it's going to be a reckoning. I think they're just wreckage with, uh, man, Baltimore's going to win and Lamar Jackson's going to have a hell of a game. And uh, let, let's let's keep in mind with Baltimore, everybody, that they have a new offensive coordinator and he's supposed to be brilliant. Georgia. We'll see. Jo- Todd, yeah. Todd Munkin. Not, yes, yes. He's supposed to be really good. I would not be sleeping on Baltimore even in the playoffs. Oh, my goodness. It, it, they're they're going to be good this year. We got five games in the middle slot on Sunday, Max. Let's start with one of the biggest rivalries in the NFL, the Packers and the Bears. Yeah, That's baby. Soldier Field, baby. The Bears are actually a one-point favorite. Max, this is a total toss-up. Jordan Love coming in. Justin Fields is going to be ready to go. I'm going Bears because they're home. Hell yeah. Bears at home, baby. I, I'm definitely going the Bears. I might choose the Bears every week. I might be choosing them every week. 16 and 0, baby. <laughs> it's not happening. It's not seven happening. Seven and nine. <laughs> seven and nine, yeah. Max. Uh, nine and seven. Let's flip that. Or, uh, or uh, yeah, whatever. Uh, go Bears. Justin Fields is going to have a hell of a game. I'm I'm picking, uh, sorry, Justin Fields, I have 100 rushing yards right off the bat. Nice. Seven and, I'm going to say seven and 10. We, we, Seven, get, oh, it's there. That one extra game game. short. Give me a game short. 17 and 0, baby. <laughs> uh, we're coming here to Denver, Colorado. The Broncos are hosting the Raiders in a divisional matchup. Sean Payton, we're going to see what he's done with Russell Wilson right off the bat. I got the Broncos winning at home, Max. Oh, little uh, biased Denver crowd over there. I don't know. Yeah. Denver, I don't know. Denver sports. Yeah. Denver sports. It's you coming, know, up. Th- coming up. Coming up. It's going to be a better game than you than we expect. A nice divisional matchup here, but I got the Raiders. I got the flip on this. Uh, I I like. I think. I think everyone, even though you have him as a queef, I think Josh Jacobs is going to run all over him, <laughs> running all over him. He very well could. He very well could. First game we differed on. Is that right? I think so. Yeah. Jeez. Jeez. Okay. Jeez. Right. Come on. All right. Come on. Sorry. Not not much Come speculation on. today. Need a third. Need a third body for this next week, huh? Uh, moving along, we got the Eagles, the defending NFC champions, going to New England, taking on Mac Jones and Big Bill and the Patriots. Uh, no surprise here, boys. I got the Eagles. 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 We got the, a juicy one here, Max. This might be the juiciest game of the week. It's got an over-under of 51, which I believe is the most. The Miami Dolphins are going on the road to take on the Los Angeles Chargers oh. in, a, in a matchup where... Oh. Two was playing Herbert. Those guys were back to back picks in the draft. My Miami was sitting there, I believe, at number five and took Tua, which left Herbert to go to number six of the Chargers. I don't know if the Dolphins, if they could redo that, they would they would take Herbert. I think I would. Uh-huh. I got the Chargers winning in a shootout and possibly the juiciest game of the week. I completely agree. There's some really good games in week one. Good good job by good job by the NFL. Good job at the NFL for uh, for giving us a, quite a show uh, for this first week. But yes, I also have the Chargers. Okay, I do believe in Justin Herbert. I, you're right; it's going to be a shootout. It might be a, a game winning field goal or a game winning touchdown in overtime. Okay, I'm very excited about it. Go Chargers! Go Chargers! Uh, staying with the divisional matchup here, the last game in the middle time slot on Sunday, the Rams are going to Seattle to take on the Seahawks. No Cooper Cup, I assume. Seahawks, Seahawks win this one by at least a touchdown. Yep. I got the Seahawks as well. I think they start out around the right foot, uh, leading off from last season. Go Seahawks. Sunday night football, week one on NBC. We see a big rivalry, a divisional matchup here, Max. The Dallas Cowboys are going on the road 
to take on Danny Dookie Dookie. Dines oh, Jones. Dookie gets up. You starting him? You starting him this week? No, I'm not starting him. <laughs> starting Herbert in that shootout. Max, you're going to think I'm crazy here, but I'm going with an upset. I'm going the Giants at home to take down the Cowboys. I'm going upset on NBC Sunday Night Football. Danny Dimes throws for two tutties. <laughs> <laughs> two picks for touchdowns. Two picks for touchdowns. The Cowboys, Cowboys defense is just outstanding. Dookie Jones is going to have 115 passing yards <laughs> and two interceptions at least. I'm going Cowboys, baby. Cowboys, CD Lamb's going to have a big game. Dak Prescott, I hope he wakes up. You know, we call him Crap Prescott on, the, on this podcast because he plays like crap. I'll tell you right now, he does. But, oh, crap. hey, th- is this his contract here? Who's that? D- uh, crap Prescott. I do not believe so. No, no, that's okay. Anyway, anyway, he's got to he's got to wake up. And him and CD Lamb, I hope they have some chemistry. I drive to CD Lamb with my number two pick. Everybody, I'm very excited about it. Juicy Cowboys. CD Lamb was a juicy pick there. Yeah. Last game that we got to get a pick here for Max is Monday Night Football. Damn it! And Aaron Rodgers is going to make his New York Jets debut. They're gonna host. The don't tell mama Super Bowl champion pick Buffalo Bills. Max, right off the bat, this is gonna be a juicy one on Monday night. Oh yeah. I think I'm going to a damn concert. I'm gonna miss it. I'm pissed. But I got the bills. Have it on your phone. Yeah. Pull, pull the phone out. Pull the phone. I'm going Bills. Uh I should ask what concert this is. You know, what with that electric. <laughs> gonna have to bring up the calendar. Max. Oh, yoke yoke lore, yoke lore. So they they had a one of our wedding songs. So oh okay, it, yeah, okay. that'll be that'll be. Well, Monday. that's nice. You guys Red gonna dance? You guys Red gonna be dancing? You'll be dancing. Red rocks is uh, always a beautiful beautiful time to spend your night. Definitely, very nice. Uh, I'm also going with the Buffalo Bills. This is gonna be a fun game though. I, I love this Monday night football game. Uh, it's gonna be closer. I think it will go into the fourth quarter. A, a good battle, but I'm going with the Buffalo Bills. Good call there, Max. That Those are going to be our game picks for week one. I believe we only differed on two, the Broncos yeah. and the Raiders and the Cowboys and the Giants. So we're pretty, we're pretty much locked in, locked in step on week one. 